doing? She's doing good. She's doing good. She's over there. She's just been down right there. She's doing good. Day to day. Day to day. And, uh, you know, if she should somehow not play to Don tomorrow or next game, Letitia, if they're going to be the, the top choice there? She's one of them. Yeah, she's one of them. She's one of them. Who are the others? <laughs> Zaya. Okay, Zaya's one of them. And uh, Rivers. And, and and maybe a little Littleton. I mean, it's got to be a committee thing. Did she do everything at practice today, or did you kind of just have it? She did some things. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> she, she's here. She's got practice stuff on. She's here. Yeah. <laughs> Which is positive. That's a positive. It sure so, is. Don, what have you seen from K-State on tape? I know they're seven and one. They yeah. played at NC State, and yeah. lost, but that's a, that's a tough team to play. What else have you seen? I mean, they're big. They they, they play the percentages. I mean, they're big. Shoot 67 percent. She's gonna take 80 percent of the shots. Um, and then they and then they shoot threes. So it's either threes or paint points. <laughs> and um, so we got you know we got. I mean she's a she's she's a, she's big, and they look for her. And if you if you are relaxing while playing her, she's gonna make you pay. So, uh, but we had a we had a good couple of days of practice where we uh, we understand the assignment and we we got executed. That team was here for a regional a few years ago. Is there anything to be gained from that team, or has it been too much? No, nah, too too. I mean, it's a totally different team and totally different uh, um, calculating approach to their style of play, and you know, so that 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 didn't help us any. I know a lot of times coaches want to look at how their team responds after a big game. So I know it's been a little over a week, close to two weeks after the UConn game. Just from what you've seen out of the team since then, what, what have you noticed and is it, is it what you wanted to see? Yeah, well, I, I mean, the UConn game was so long ago that uh, we, we, we had so much time in between. Um, this team is, is, is one that, I mean, they just want to win. So it's, it's on to the next opponent. And, you know, I know they want to win, and I want to win, but there's a certain way you win. And we're, we're forever in that process of playing great basketball every time that we step on the floor. And it's hard because you got a lot of young players who they, they, they don't know. You know, they don't know from, from one play to the next, and you got to play at a high level every time you step on the floor. And that's a that's a learned thing. Going off of that, so much was made of Aaliyah's performance the other night. We see her out there yeah. working now. How hard is it and how much work does it take to make those types of nights consistent throughout an entire season? It's hard to be perfect. I don't even know if she'll be perfect again. Um, you know, but when you take good shots, when you take good shots, you give yourself a real good shot at, at making them. And she does not take shots, you know, outside of the rim of what she does, or or the rhythm of of our of our offense. She probably takes less, you know, than she probably should take. So I mean, and I, I know I probably had to apologize to to her, Leah and um, Alyssa, because they they played well for us. They played well when so many, you know, so much of our other play was not the way we want to play. So. You know, kudos to Leah for, you know, having a perfect night and um, just putting us on her shoulders. And, and how it was promising from E, who gave us some nice passes, rebounds, just defensive effort. So, um, and I don't want to take that away from them or, or lightly because it wasn't all good. It wasn't all good. Donna, if Letitia or Sonia, whoever has to play a little bit of extended minutes at the point, from a former point guard, What's the difference between being a true point guard and bringing the ball up? Um, the difference is, is is knowing when, when, and and where. You know, with uh, with Letitia, you know she's uh, she's a go 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 go, and she, you know she got to be able to play fast to slow, slow to fast, and you know understand it. But I, I mean, I, I like fast. I do because we got a fast team, and um, she gives us. A, a different dimension than even, you know, having Henny. Um, and then Rivers is just trying to figure it out, you know, and sometimes putting her at the point guard position, you lose all the greatness that she brings to the table because she's thinking about, you know, what play to run, how do I just fit in? And 
So I'm, I'm a little skeptical just taking her off of it and letting her do her thing from the wing position. Um, Littleton, uh, more set up, you know, half court, still thinking. Again, she's thinking we can't get to her shot, so we can't get to the, the best things that they do. So, you know, you, it leaves you with L.A., um, little Zaya, um, but all of them will probably play a little bit of it tomorrow. Any concern with Zaya specifically about it? I mean, her playing the point, does it take away from her scoring ability at all? Nope. Because you ask him to distribute? It, it, it doesn't because, you know, we put the ball in her hands and we, we, we make, we, we shorten the playbook for her. Yeah. So it's either this or that. And she's initiating all of that and she's the first option in it. And um, she's been doing a pretty good job at creating for herself and, and others. Don, have you seen the freshmen be able to fit? We know from a talent standpoint how talented they were coming in. But I'm blinded by that face mask. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, you have the most uh, recent uh, Super Bowl, uh, all right? Just right, sure. all right. <laughs> um, how, how have they been able to just pick up from just like from a college standpoint, right? You know, just being able to understand the game. I know it's probably player to player, but yeah. just big picture. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's good, it's bad, it's ugly. I mean, that's what that's what the freshman cycle is, you know. Um, you know, but I, they have great like leaders, like the, the core group of our players really help them. And they, I, I know their their bad days aren't as bad because of who they're spending it with. Um, obviously they want to play, they want to contribute, they want to make an impact. Um, and hopefully that that maturation process takes place so they can really help us. If if they get comfortable, they, they, they'll be able to help us. I just don't think they're comfortable day to day. Moment to moment is, you know, it's, it's hard. So once they get settled in and get comfortable, you'll see some more consistency out of them. Don, as far as Destiny goes, did she have like a scan on the leg and is, and I guess it must have come back without any problematic results or else she would probably be out there, right? Right, she's just day to day. So she could wake up tomorrow and just be like, hey. Like the rest of us, right? Right, <laughs> right, right. Actually, she'll probably better than me, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> At my age, she probably, we're gonna yeah. wake up yeah. even with whatever she's got going on. Thank you guys, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.